Hi there guys, this is Tracy from Livinia Stamps and welcome to another demonstration today. We are going to continue using our lovely sticker stencils. So we're staying with the Christmas theme and today we are going to be using one from our sticker stencil 2 set and I'm going to use the tree. And this makes a really nice, quick, easy Christmas card. So I've got the multifarious card here and I'm going to use the negative. So let's just take that off. And then line that up in the center there, like so. Give that a good press down. Make sure you press all these little bits on the edge here. Make sure they're nice and flat. And that way the stencil brush won't go underneath and you get a nice sharp edge. So, ready to go. The first colour we're going to use is the Blue Atoll, which is from our new colours from the Elements range. And I'm using our larger stencil brush. So just inking that up. It's gorgeous, gorgeous blue. It's like a sky blue. Um, really nice colour. So I'm taking a little off first and then I'm going to just sweep that over the top. Now you can use any colour theme you wish. I'm picking blues and reds today just because I like that colour combination. But you can, as I say, use this technique, whichever favourite colours that you decide you'd like to see. So I'm just evening that colour out by going over and over. And that's our first layer. So our second layer, we're going to use the Blue Lagoon. And I'm moving down to the next size stencil brush that's our medium size inking up and you can see that difference uh, colour there. It's a really nice blue again, much deeper than the other one. And I'm going to go over the edge, just swirling round and round. Taking it over that edge but not covering the whole thing. I'm going to keep that centre nice and light. And then lastly, I'm going to move on to the Midnight Blue, which is a lovely deep, deep blue. And I'm using a tiny stencil brush, and this is great for detail, just for the edging. I'm literally just going to kiss that edge. with that colour. And this will give it a really nice depth. And it will make the image look a little bit more three-dimensional rather than a flat image. It will give it some nice dimension. So I'm just working my way over the edge. And down at the bottom there. all the way around. And there we go. So moving on now, I'm going to use one of our worded stamps. This is our Christmas words. And I'm going to ink up in Glamorous. This is a gorgeous red, a sort of pink red. So ink up. I am going to take that first impression off and then stamp over the top. And again, there we go. And I've got the word Christmas just repeated over and over. So 
So now we're going to take that stencil off. And you can see that lovely sharp edge that we've got. And I'm going to pop that back onto the sheet it came off. And all you need to do is just give it a give it a bit of a wipe down and um, it will work again and again and again. The sticky will remain. So now we're going to put some more words on. I have to think then for a minute. So we've got the twilight here. So in cap, I'm going to take off. I only want these words to be very much in the background. So give that a good press. Ink up. Take off. And again. In the background. Just repeat that. On this side. And again on this side. Okay. And now we can actually decorate the tree. So I've got stickles here. And all I'm going to do is just draw some lines going across, like we've got tinsel going over and around the tree. You don't have to stick with this colour, you can use whichever colour you like. So, all the way to the top. And I think that looks so effective. That lovely glitter, I hope you can see that. And then I'm going to use the liquid pearls. So this colour is the raspberry. And all I'm going to do is just dot. And I think this colour stands out so nicely against that blue. So just keep that pressure on the bottle and just move your hand, steady it on your mat or on your paper. Create a little platform for your hand. And that way it'll keep it nice and steady. There we go. How effective does that look? It's so quick and simple. So next step, we're going to use the Prosper pen. So let's give that a shake. And all I'm gonna do is just tap with the brush. Just diagonally across the card. Just to give it a little bit of a snowy effect. Like so. I'm going to pop that to the side and then taking another card that's slightly bigger, we're going to use some of our gilding polish. I've picked a blue. Just pick a little of that up and then we're just going to take that over the edge. And it's a gorgeous, almost like a petrol blue this. It's got a tiny bit of green in it as well. So working my way around. And just let it, let that first layer dry off just literally a few seconds. These are water based so they do dry very quickly. 
and then we're going to go with a second coat Okay, so that's given us a really nice blue background. And we can pop that over the top. And I think that complements it really nicely. So let's pop a little bit of blue on the back. Pop it in place. And there we have it. So I hope you enjoyed today's demo and I hope it's inspired you to have a go at the sticker stencils yourselves. They are so much fun and so easy to use. Anyway, you take care and I'll see you soon. Bye for now.